Hello everyone, this is Mara and welcome back to Stardew Valley. So let's first take care of our crops. Let's see, there it is. This is something that we have to do every day while we still have energy left. <laughs> so let's go here. Oh, and actually, I'm not quite sure why, but I decided to disable the music last time. Uh, I actually recorded several episodes uh, back to back. Uh, last time, so it has been a while <laughs> since I recorded. But anyway, let's ena enable the music. I really do like the music and it's very relaxing. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so let's take care of the crops first and then check out what kind of quests we have. Like I said, it has been a little while like a week since I recorded so I'm not sure uh, where we left off I have been playing my other save in this game and I'm I'm quite a long way from from this situation that we are right now okay let's go and get some some more water almost done with the crops and hi puppy <laughs> Okay, let's see. Just a few more. This game is just so much fun. It's so relaxing. Okay, so we are done with the crops. I I'm pretty sure. Yes, we don't have any other any other uh, things going on. And let's check out the delivery. Ah, I see. So Harvey wants a earth crystal. I'm not sure if we can actually deliver that. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it might be that we can't actually deliver that right now. But let's take care of this. You don't uh, have to put water in the bowl. It doesn't uh, matter with the gameplay. But I do feel bad if I haven't <laughs> haven't given him him some water okay so actually let's go let's go and check out if we can find some uh, spring onions that's something that we could always use and let's go check out if we can see some other crops and I do know that it's actually quite useful to clear out this weeds wherever we see them because it actually enables the game to spawn um, some harvestable things so ooh, there's one already so that's good to do once in a while so let's take care of this and I don't believe we are actually using any energy while we are using the scythe so that's that's awesome too so just to uh, help the game a little bit and make it so that there can be um, some crops spawning in these areas. I'm just going to clear out this a little bit. Okay. And let's see. I think it was... Here we go. Okay. Are there any spring onions here? I hope so. Yes, that's awesome. This is going to help us a lot since we only have so much money right now. Um, are there any more here? Maybe down here? Nope. That's fine. So let's go to the town. And did we actually, I think we built the bridge last time. So let's go and check out the beach if we can find some coral or sea urchins or anything like that and I really need to keep my eye on the worms as well I love this music <laughs> it's just awesome 
Okay, so let's go here. We could definitely use the money. Ah, oh, there's something already. That's awesome. That's awesome. Let's get those. Any worms? Nope. Oh, and there's one more. One more clam. Awesome. Let's talk with this guy. Yes, thank you. I think it is. Ah, oh, that's awesome. Okay, let's go and get those. Oh, this is good money right here. Okay. Yeah, so it's not too bad, actually. We are doing pretty pretty nicely. And let's let's check out something, actually. I think we, we did unlock the, the community center a little while back. And we can actually start um, fulfilling this one. So we can start uh, bringing some crops. We don't have those yet. Or at least I need to go and check if we do have some of those. And there's also some... Um, yeah, we completed this this bundle already. And we can't get that. Let's see. We don't have any of those yet. Not those. Not those. But yeah, here we go. The crab pot bundle. So we have clams. We could go and put, the, put at least that there already and we need to keep an eye on mussels and oysters and periwinkles and all these things so that we can actually start uh, completing those bundles and get some rewards from those too so that's exciting so you know what guys while we are here let's just go ahead and go to the let's go to the community center Let's check out. There's nothing there right now. How are you, Louis? 20 years. Well, that's exciting. <laughs> well, I'm glad you like being a mayor. Okay, any crops? I don't see any. Let's clear out those. Oh, mixed seeds. That's awesome. Okay, so I believe this is the fish one. Yes. And we can place one of those clams there already. That's awesome. I'm pretty sure you can can you use coral for something. I'm not sure what. Um, and actually, I think we haven't unlocked that one yet. So it's uh, later on in the game. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Because I don't think we actually unlocked these ones. Nope. Yeah, sorry guys, it has it's a little difficult. I've been playing playing so much with my other save <laughs> and I didn't quite remember at what point we left off in this in this world. Okay, let's see artisan no spring spring crops. So this is something that we need to keep in mind. We need to make sure that we bring all these crops here and I, I actually I forgot already if we do have all the um, all the crops planted. I'm not sure about that, but let's just double check this because Mara is a derp. <laughs> yes, exotic. Okay, yeah, we don't have anything for that. I don't think. So let's just go back home. Let's check out what is the situation with our garden. I'm actually, I feel like we just planted some of the uh, spring crops. It's still day seven, so we have plenty of uh, plenty of time to harvest those uh, spring crops, seasonal crops. So, so let's see. Hi, how are you? Yes, that's very true. Uh, 
Ah, oh, yes, yes. Okay, let's see. Do we see any any worms here? No. And that's not unlocked either. Okay, so let's go here. I wish there was a way to tell what kinds of crops you have been you have planted in case you have as as horrible memory as I do. <laughs> so yeah, we planted a ton of things here. I think we planted some mixed um, uh, spring seeds here, like all of these. And I'm hoping that we planted some, some seasonal crops. So we just need to wait for those guys to grow, I guess. But let's go here and we can sell, we can sell that at least. You know what, guys? We can sell all this, I'm pretty sure. I don't think we need that. But let's keep the horse uh, radish just in case if we need, need it for some, some things. Oh, we have one already. Okay, we have a parsnip. Let me check this out. Okay, so we could actually go and deliver this already. But I think we are going to wait for the other other crops to grow and let's see oh there's an eel too <laughs> you know what I think we should make another chest yeah let's do so let's make another chest do I have any wood only six is that all I have <laughs> oh goodness gracious I need to go and chop down some wood I guess yeah, let's make another chest for fish and and crabs and all kinds of things. I do want to keep my game organized because there's going to be so many items uh, later on, and it's it's just very helpful to to make sure that you are uh, at least decently organized. <laughs> okay, so let's take care of these. These are just annoying and in the way. And my energy is going down very fast. But let's see, there we go. And how many wood do we need to make a chest? We need 50. Oh, that's actually a ton of wood. I've got already how much you would need for that. And okay, I'm stuck. Okay, let's take care of these. These are just in a way. Okay, there we go. And let's take care of that. Okay, I think we should have enough, yes. So let's go and make a chest. And we can put it, let's see, can I place it right here? I can, that's awesome. Okay, so the eel goes there. And let's see, what do we have here? All kinds of random things. Okay, so let's put that there. Let's put the sap away and the seeds and the fibers away and let's plant these seeds so we need to make some more room I guess so let's see one more okay that's good and where's the water bucket or the watering can okay awesome and the night is coming so, uh, do we have anything else that we could do right now? We could clear out the area a little bit. Let's take care of these, actually. All the stone. We need a ton of stone later to be able to um, get some new buildings going and whatnot. And especially the silo. We need to make sure that we can do that. And 
I believe that we are going to use a ton of a ton of stone for that. So we only have we don't even have fifty of those. I feel like we need at least a hundred stone. And we need some more clay. So we need to collect some more. So hopefully we are able to find some clay. I'm not sure if you if you can um at this point if you can find it any anywhere else besides just digging around. Okay, there we go. So we are running out of energy. Let's go inside. Let's check out the TV. Stir fry. That's awesome. And how is the weather? Clear and sunny all day tomorrow. Let's go there and light up the fire and go to bed. So thanks so much guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Stardew Valley and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.